If you normally run for the GO train, you'll have to run a little faster. Here's a look at what commuters need to know as Metrolinx makes a minor tweak to the schedule. Have you ever caught a GO train by the skin of your teeth? All the time. All the time. <laughs> Spontaneous. <laughs> Starting first thing Monday morning, GO train doors will be closing one minute before departure, a move that Metrolink says will help keep trains running on time. Have to run to the train. You're so, going to have to run faster. Yeah, I'm going to have to be Usain Bolt. Do you know Usain yes, Bolt? Yes. yes. And while one minute may not sound like a big deal, for commuters like Nassim, every single second counts. My watch is actually like 10 minutes forward because I know that I was missing, so it's it's all good. Oh, wow. Like, yeah. You really are a last-minute person. Yeah, I am, I am. <laughs> Do you think that's going to go over well? Then I think they should have that minute directed from the time they show on the boards as well. Oh. So people don't have that confusion that they still have one minute with them. So if they are actually trying to uh, do that, they should probably reduce that time from the board as well. Metrolink says it has been communicating with customers through the PA system, alerts and on-train announcements since January 2nd. But this could be news to more casual commuters and those who are wrapping up their holidays today as kids are heading back to school in the morning. Do you anticipate on Monday morning seeing a lot more people on the, on the platform waving goodbye? Yeah, I think so. Are you going to feel bad for the people who are like, why are the doors closed? It's going to be the first day. Once they find out, they'll they'll know one minute right. advance. I'll wear my flat shoes, no heels. So it's right. Good. <laughs> now, Metrolink says this change will not impact Up Express or Go buses and that it will be keeping close tabs on commuter feedback. At Union Station, Shauna Hunt City News.